I don't know what to say, really. Three minutes till the biggest battle of our professional lives all comes down to today. Either we heal as a team or we're going to crumble. Inch by inch, play by play, till we're finished. We're in hell right now, gentlemen. Believe me. And we can stay here, get the shit kicked out of us, or we can fight our way back. My career as a professional free skier had just started over a month before the crash that changed my life. This is a very dangerous sport that we all love and it takes a lot of concentration and passion and love to keep going and progressing. But of course, that's just the way it is. I guess the follow-up question would be, is it worth it? And the answer to that is also a very big yes. The hardest tricks were doubles. No one did any triples yet. And that was what I was going for. A switch double card in 1080. A blast of wind changed everything and I overshot the landing in my switch double car 1080. And the next thing I knew was waking up from the hospital about two and a half months later. I do not remember anything in between. My name is Billion Emelan and, and I'm the head trainer of Sports Science Life Turbo. Becca has evolved, evolved very well. Um, balance has gotten a lot better. And friends have, have already said that his, his movement, his walking gait is much better. And, and um, I think he's improved very, very well. Whatever the movement is, we always try to do everything as well as possible. We start slow and um, once we master whatever whatever the movement is, we then try to um, pick up speed a little bit. And that's how we that's how we challenge the nervous system. Every time I go to a rehab center, I have my little fun part of it for sure in the process. So if you have that, then it's like a little cake in there. Do whatever you can to make whatever is hurt better, and after that, it will all come back. I fell into coma right after the crash. In, in August, I got out of the hospital and moved in the rehabilitation center, which was a perfect place for me. That was the place where my fight actually began. My rehabilitation has been amazingly fast, even though I still have numerous problems. For example, in my speech, this is not my voice. It's not fun to speak in a stupid voice like this. I have only one goal, to fight back and come the best I can possibly be. Wish you all the best, Becca. Stay strong and uh, fight back, my man. Fight back. Take care.